Hi, Mika. Hello. How are you? I was born good. We are wrapping up 2022. Yes. What have you learned from this year? Well, this year has, has, has been really long for me, to be honest. And it's been very challenging because I moved back to Africa after being away for nine years. And when I was coming back, I didn't know if I'm gonna stay here. So I was just coming to pass to another country, right? That was the, that was the goal. But when I landed here in Tanzania, you know, a year ago, I knew that I'm supposed to be here. So I stayed. And I think that was the beginning of blessings and the opportunities that I was talking about all the time. You know that a lot of time we see we want opportunities to come to us but mm. opportunities are everywhere actually whatever you are you can see the opportunities god has given us everything everything you want is right here and i think that has been reality in my life in 2022 mm. it has been tough um you know but i think i've never lived my purpose before right this has been kind of like the moment that i really leave my purpose i leave i am who i'm called to be and obviously i made a lot of mistakes along the way and i've learned that god is still good you know when even when we're not good even when we're not faithful he is god you know as as a human being we you know we tend to make mistakes sometimes maybe because of the disobedience to him or sometimes we just don't listen we have this stubbornness inside of us but when god he plans to do something it doesn't matter what he's stepping in the way you know he's just gonna do it and I, so i've seen god using me regardless of and i think that it really reminded me that god he's seeking for people who are ready and he can use anybody and as long as you are you you keep following him you keep leaning on to him and you know, he's just gonna do it. Right. Yeah, so right now I can say my life is in so much better place. Not because of money, because I don't have money. Not because of fame, because I don't have a fame. Not because of people, because I don't have people. Of course, I have my family, I have, you know, friends, but, um, you know, sometimes God is just directing people towards me, you know. You know, when, when you're doing his purpose and you want to do something, you just see like things are working miraculously. Like right. I meet people that I never expected to meet. I work with people that I never expected to work with because kind of like God directed our path hmm. to meet somewhere. And so we are here achieving, you know, and actualizing our plans and our goal to unite Africa. And it's just happening like that. Right. You've mentioned a bit about mistakes, that you have had your own series of mistakes, right? Somebody out there is watching you right now thinking, wow, we, we're almost wrapping up this year. I've made lots of mistakes. Maybe God doesn't want to hear me. Oh. Maybe I can't pray. Maybe I can't achieve what had pinned down on January. What are you telling that person right now? Well, you know, mistakes is the part of life. Hmm. Uh, as a human being, you make mistakes. Some of them you like them, some of them you're not going to like them. You know, some of them you might learn from it, some of them you might not even learn from it. Hmm. Uh, you know, but that's part of the life, you know. And the most important thing is to know that you're going to make mistakes. Uh, but what do you do after realizing that, oh, I've just made a mistake? I always tell the people that I work close with that, you know, don't do the same mistake twice because that means you're not growing. Right. If tomorrow I do the same mistake I've done today, I'm not learning from it. I'm not learning, I'm not growing. So make new mistakes, all right? God does not make any mistake, and that's what makes him God, right? And when we lean onto him, we become like him, right? And we are clean because he is clean, you know? We are holy because he is holy, not because of my action, not because of anything. So whatever, maybe um, I'm talking too spiritually, but <laughs> because everything in this world, you know, in this physical world, it starts from, you spirit. know, somewhere, yeah. spirit. Yeah, so whether you make mistakes, uh, okay, all of us are making mistakes, but know that 
That's what makes you a human being. So is there a chance for me to finish big and better, even if I've made mistakes throughout the year? Of course, the chance is there. You know, it is there as long as you look up to God, you know. Don't look at your mistake because mistakes are not your God. You know, what God is I bigger too, I than that. I feel too sinful. I feel like I'm too sinful for this. Can God forgive me? <laughs> There's no single sin that God cannot forgive. Uh, you know, I think sometimes we feel that in Africa perspective, you know. There's a lot of things we do. You know, in Africa, we kill each other. You know, in Africa, we, you know, we hate one another. In a way, you know, that's why we're fighting for, for one Africa, one Africa. Because it happens, you know and you know most of the time i feel like the blood is in my hand like i have blood on my hand because i am african whatever that my brothers and sister did i feel like i've done it as well um you know but but there's always that you know return i mean when you turn away from whatever you're doing and you try to make things right you might not make everything right but um you know with god things can change can be changed and so i don't know you should not let anything back you down so more, a lot of time you know motivational speakers they say don't let anybody stop you uh -huh. but i'll tell you this don't let yourself stop yeah. you yeah. don't let your sin stop you don't let your mistakes stop you move forward move beyond those mistakes understand that there's no righteous person in this earth we are all sinners but you know, we're good because He is good. God is good and good is God. You understand what I'm saying? So that's what motivates me to move forward, to keep moving, whatever, how many attacks I receive, you know, how many mistakes I make, no matter what, I'm, you know, I, I'm still learning, I'm still growing and we are all still learning and growing. And we should only focus on God because He's the center of everything. And through Him, with Him, we can do anything. And I will do everything through him who gives me strength we are going to unite africa uh. through him you know what i'm saying so everything is possible man nothing is impossible and i'm going to achieve every single thing according to his plan we're doing it we'll do it and we'll forever do it right thank you so much mika thank you